Welcome to our guide to Argyll. This is the 21st title in our series of audio travel guides and an update of an earlier title on Argyll and the Isles, first recorded in 2003. All our guides are available in compact disc format and as downloads via our website. We've sold over one million tracks to date. The guides are sponsored by and feature quality local businesses en route, hand-selected for the listeners' convenience and enjoyment. They offer the very best places to visit, eat, drink and stay. From castles to cottages, galleries to general stores, inns to private islands, romantic country house hotels to farmhouse bed and breakfasts. A map and full listing can be found in the insert booklet or as web links online. We do hope you enjoy your trip to Argyll and visit as many as you're able. Argyll is not an area to cover in haste. It's over 100 miles from Ardnamurchan in the north to the Mull of Kintyre in the south and about the same from Loch Lomond in the east to the Isle of Iona in the west. Indeed, its coastline is longer than that of France. The birthplace of a nation, the seat of a once all-powerful seaborne dynasty, the cradle of Christianity, its history is amazing. The outstanding wildlife includes once extinct species, such as sea eagles, reintroduced a number of years ago, whilst Napdale has been selected to trial the reintroduction of beaver. The scenery is breathtaking, lapped by the Atlantic Ocean with numerous sandy bays and rugged cliffs. Inland stand magnificent mountains amid heather-clad moorland, edged by vast forests, interspersed by deep sea and freshwater lochs. The largest of the Hebridean islands, Mull, is featured, as are the smallest, Gia and Iona, alongside the islands of Islay, Jura and Butte. An inspiring mix of island, sea and mountain in a grand and complex pattern. Argyll is one of the most beautiful and enchanting places you may ever visit.